just don't get it. I, I'm thinking today of, of this revival in Kentucky, so-called revival. Under God. I mean, I've got multiple problems with that. I hadn't heard that mentioned since I've been here. I mean, are y'all scared to say Asbury revival? And I don't care what you think. Don't, don't try to take something out of context. If they're not for us, they're against us. Don't use that in that context. You're probably preaching millennial texts for now too. Amen. You all right? Everybody listen at me. We're in a mess that our young people immediately, all of those that have already deserted us and their children are liking all of that. I got a problem when they're having Holy Eucharist. If that's not Catholic, they ain't a cow in Texas. Somebody say amen. amen. They're going to drink the blood of Jesus and eat the cannibals. Uh, and that's sanctioned under a Wesleyan holiness that believe in eradication of the flesh, second work in the grace, sinless perfection. And then look what they're acting like. Look up in here. God ain't within a thousand miles of that doing to them. And if you're naive enough to think that, you think wrestling's real. So somebody say amen. Those kind of movements, they have an emotional start. And I'm for shouting. We, we shout at the drop of a hat, and we bring our hat and drop it at church most of the time. Amen. It starts with emotion. It, it is sensationalism that sells it. They get a big following. It, it's a, a ecumenicalism. It's ecumenical that defines it. And then they, skepticism automatically, they, that angers them. If you have any question about it, 11 out of the chapel speakers at that Holiness Wesleyan College in Asbury were women. Now look up here, friend. Don't bow your head, I'm not ready to pray yet. God has never yet and never will call a woman to preach. Unless you have a genderless Bible. If any man desire the office of vision, he desireth a good work. Let him be the husband of one wife. I mean, it's, it's very clear who's called to preach. They've embraced that. And, and you mark that crowd by their fruits, you shall know them. Who's attracted to that crowd? I meant to say, if Greg Locke's going to it, we don't need to be going to it. Is everybody okay? Hey, man, oh, yes. A while ago.